hello again everybody and welcome back to our channel and firstly let me just say oh, we hope that you've had an amazing Christmas yes we have we've had a blast people so we are now heading for sunny Benidorm so we're on the road and uh, I think we're gonna stop somebody uh, one of them wants to shut stop at decathlon so there's uh, got a flat tire in his butch in his yeah uh, in the scooter, in the scooter. So we're stopping at one of those and then before we head to the site but we can't get on the site till around 2 p.m so we just virtually just, yeah we're just wasting time but yeah enjoying the sunny weather robert's actually got rid of his fleece this morning now i've got bloody bits everywhere i know that yeah his uh his ankles really swole and i've got one on my horse did he really just say that did he but he has <laughs> happy with that i haven't um yeah so we'll uh i'll just show you around actually just that we're heading towards benidorm and you can see the mountains in the distance i can't remember the name of those but i think benidorm is the other side of those so it's not far it's only about three quarters of an hour this is the way we actually came in earlier uh, yesterday because we're just passing the sign it is back to front on here into denier what a place what an absolutely stunning park that we had as you saw yeah and can i uh can i just say there's a there's a there's a few of uh, our subs uh, going to benedorm i think yes there is there's a few there or heading there so it'd be nice to uh, bump into you if you're over there yeah and i we both want to say a massive thank you to mr paul powell mr the, uh, paul powell's only give me a he sent us a super thanks of £10 to buy us uh, a drink for our wedding anniversary. So yeah. we will raise a glass to you on uh, when we get into Benidorm. And yeah. so thank you so, so much. Yeah, Mr. Paul Paul, thanks, mate. Yeah, we really appreciate it. It's, uh, yeah, it's pretty amazing. So Happy thank with that, you again. Happy. It saves him buying me a drink, doesn't it? Being as you bought one. I did think that. <laughs> so yeah, I'll uh, pick you up when we get closer to it. I just thought I'd put the uh, camera back on and show you beautiful scenery yet again driving into the sunny Benidorm. We are about uh, 15, I'm going to let me check the map, We're about 20 minutes away I think, but it's absolutely beautiful. As you can see. It's now 22 degrees, people. Yeah, we're not rubbing it in, I promise. Honest we're not, but I've had to take my cardio off. Robert's fleece has gone. It's uh, it's a very warm, beautiful, sunny, sunny Spanish day. Can't whack it. No, really, really, really can't. Not rubbing it in, I promise. Here we go, going through another tunnel tunnel of Mascarat through the mountain it's the best way to travel through mountains straight roads I hope you can see this is a bit clearer than the last one because it's just clean try to clean the windscreen off lovely can't be just going tunnel. through the love tunnel shut up Robert you tart And the windscreen's looking very riffy, so I'm hoping you've been able to pick some of that up. Is that Benidorm? I don't know. Yes, we're in Benidorm. Benidorm, no, that's the road to take, the N332. I don't think it is, it's too that's low. That's in, Benidorm's in the distance. So we are going through. I'll try and move the camera around. That for a backdrop again, beautiful mountains. Yeah, that looks uh, if you can see over there. You can't bear with me a second until the trees move. That looks very pretty. You can't whack a bit of bed at all, people. scenery. Beautiful. Bloody hot to know that. 
Yeah, well, we'll soon be on Levante Beach with a, a pint of sangria. Well, I get our bikini as well. You'll get your bikini on, I'll get my mankini on. If I do that, it'll, it'll snow. I'm not doing that. And there we go. In front is our first view of Benidorm. Sunny Benidorm. Yeah, it's showing 22 degrees at the moment. Use the right lane to take exit 65 towards N332 and there Benidorm. we go. There is Benidorm. Full of skyscrapers. Let's drive through that window, you'll see better. So yeah, that is our first view of Benidorm. Looks extremely built up, but there's a beach, there's bars, there's sangria. Take the exit. You have to excuse the sat nav because I'm using my phone as well as the other one, just to make sure we get to the right place. Wow. Here, oh, we've drove so many miles. We have, and we've just said, I cannot believe we've actually driven to Benidorm. I mean, that's an achievement, in it. I know lots of people have done it, but for us, it's uh, a massive achievement. I'm really, uh, really, in really impressed. Mile, Are you impressed? Right to merge onto N332 towards Alicante. Wait for the bloody phone to shut up. There we go. Uh, are you impressed a minute? Uh, Getting into Benidorm. Well, you've done good. That's about it. With the skinny dipping people, you can't whack it. Definitely not. It's my anniversary. I don't want to be uh, ill on my, in, uh, on my anniversary. Oi! Believe me. Keep right to merge onto N332 towards Alicante. And Benidorm goes on and on by the look of it. It's, uh, it's just hotel after hotel after hotel. Use the left lane to keep left to merge onto N332 towards Alicante. Look at that for a hotel, there's a hole in the middle. What a waste of space that is. But it does look <laughs> very cool. But it does, they could have got more rooms, couldn't they? Unbelievable. Yeah. This one looks very cool, doesn't it? So there we go. Benny Dawn, we made it. You'll have to excuse the two sat navs because I've got my phone going and the one in the dash, but I just wanted to film us. Uh, going in. Exit the roundabout onto Avenida Comunidad Europea. There we go. Continue on Avenida Comunidad Europea for 800 metres. Beautiful blue skies. Amazing. At roundabout, take third exit. Happy with that, are you? Yeah, we've just been uh, tipped off the site we're going on. It's absolutely rammed and the pitch that they've allocated us is small so yeah it's going to be fun again trying to get uh, trying to get pitched up but we'll let you know how it goes and once we're on we're on for five days so in 300 meters at the roundabout take yeah. the third exit onto say, Avenida de la Comunita Valenciana happy bloody holidays folks happy holidays so yeah I'm going to put it down now until we get there so we can concentrate on getting in the right direction Right everybody, we've managed to park up at Camping Armanello Benidorm. Uh, so this is the pitch. Uh, fair size pitch. We have electric and a tap over there. We've got the toilet and shower block right, literally right next to us. Now that might bother some people, but to us, to be honest, it's a bit of a bonus because you haven't got so far to walk if you want a nice hot shower. And the uh, the rain showers, absolutely amazing, bang on. So I'll just take you a quick look around the site. Oh, hang on a sec, I've got to mention this. We've had some more friends join us over there, Brad and Janice, which is good. As you can imagine, the site is very, very busy. Mostly Brits, which is good. Because I can understand them. Everybody's uh, happy, excited for the big day. Christmas day. Uh, let's have a look. Where can we go? You've got some, uh, I think they're hol holiday lets there. There's obviously a lot of people living on the site. Uh, 
is a plan of the site. Now I think, I'm not sure yet because you pay it as you leave. You just uh, go to the reception, give them your passport, or show them your passport, book it, and then you pay when you leave. We think it's about £125. £125, Euros. sorry, forgot what country I was in. <laughs> €125. Euros. Uh, on top of that, that's for five days. On top of that, you have to pay for your electricity. We're not going to be using much because the weather's glorious. It's warm. All you need, all we need for really is to charge the scooters up because we're using those a lot. So yeah, all is good. I'll just show you a quick scan the camera around. Pictures. Benadorm. Yeah, it's quite a nice sight with all the trees and whatever. Yeah, I like it here. It's nice. Yeah, so you come in down there. You've got a restaurant just there. And just over there, you pull up. And as I said before, just show me passport booking. Find a pitch and then pay as you come out. Yes. All is good people, all is good. It's a bit cloudy today but over there, the backdrop of this place is amazing. And you've even got a swimming pool. If it's heated or not, I don't know. But that's pretty good. You can also get gas here. And I think you can hire bikes. Which is also pretty handy. And also on site, you have a supermarket. Just up there. Let's go and have a look actually, see what they've got. Yeah, I've just had a quick look in the supermarket. They've got, uh, they sell fresh bread and croissants and things like that. Which I'm happy about to be honest. Because I do all the cooking, as you probably know, while Lynn just sits there looking pretty. <laughs> She's going to kill me when she sees this. <laughs> and can I just say, uh, we're about, I think we're about 10, 15 minutes walk away from Benidorm, which we'll be walking into a bit later on, I think, to have a look around. So that's good, it's situated pretty good, to be honest. Uh, Steve and Susie, our friends, they're uh, like about, I don't know, five, five kilometres away. So they've got a bit further to travel to get into Benidorm. That's another good reason why you need push bikes, electric bikes or e-scooters. Because you can see so much more and get about so easily. And the amount of people over here who've got electric scooters is unbelievable. They're everywhere. Our other friends that are with us, uh, Trev and Luz, have stuck them down there right in the corner, which is, you know, just a few hundred yards away from us, to be honest. So that's good. That's settled. Well, they're happy. Everybody's happy. Life is good. And it's a cracking, sunny, beautiful day here at Benidorm on the beach. It really is. There's so many people around. It is heaving. You'd think it was summer. Absolutely. Well, it is summer to us over here. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Can't believe how many people are up and about. Yeah, let me uh, spin the camera around and I'll show you. Surprisingly enough, not many on the beach. <laughs> Few folk over there on the lounges, but not too many on the beach. Everybody is up there and round the streets of Benidorm. So, before we go any further, I found out a few interesting facts about Benidorm. 
Benidorm was Spain's first package holiday resort. Uh, Benidorm has almost as many skyscrapers as Madrid. Benidorm put in a bid for UNESCO World Heritage Status in 2015. Uh, Brits invented the Costa Blanca. The 200 kilometres sandy stretch across Alicante incorporates Benidorm that hasn't always been the Costa Blanca. Now the defunct British European Airways invented the name which translates as White Coast. How about that? Uh, it was the first place in Spain that you could actually wear a bikini. And there are also almost a thousand, no, there are more than a thousand bars in Benidorm. And we've only sampled one. Yeah. Interesting fact from Lynn. Yes, facts. Facts. I'm, I'm full of them. When I've got a phone in front of me anyway. I'm full of something. Unbelievable. Good morning, everybody. We, Good. we wrapped on it yesterday, didn't we? We did. It um, was heaving, as you saw. Yeah. So what we thought we'd do, we'd come out early this morning. What time is it? It's nine o'clock. Just to have a look around. And it's Christmas Day. Happy Christmas, everybody. Happy Christmas. Uh, my voice is going. <coughs> we uh, we ended up in a karaoke bar last night, all of us. Yeah. And what a fantastic night we had. Oh, it was, a f oh, it was amazing last night. <laughs> yeah, and we got lost <coughs> on the way back. But we're we? losing our voices now. <laughs> and we met yeah. a couple of subs, haven't we? Yeah. A couple of subscribers over here, which is good. Yeah. Had a drink with them. Brilliant. Yeah, we had a really, really good night. So, yeah, we thought we'd get up early-ish. It's not really early, is it, for you? No. Um, yeah, and we'll have a, have a walk around Benidorm while it's quiet. Yeah, there's a bit of a story last night. We got lost. Mm, we did. We were following Somebody you. took the wrong uh, turning. <laughs> yeah, we ended up on a main road and we ended up, I don't know. Oh, we, we must have done 20 miles <laughs> to do a two-mile journey. Yeah, we've never laughed so much. There was, there was yeah. the four of us left yeah. and we just we were totally lost. Yeah. But hey-ho, didn't matter, did it? That's life, people. <laughs> That's life. Yeah, so what a difference. Skyscrapers and there's bar after bar after bar after bar and there's my little fruitcake. And as I said, there are over a thousand bars and we've sampled three? Three bars. Three, that's all. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, I must say about Benidorm, the atmosphere is amazing. Yeah. It really is. Everybody's so friendly and just, you know, out for the laugh. Yeah, and as, as I mean, most of you know, I wasn't too, looking forward to it too much, but wow, loving it, absolutely yeah, yeah. loving it. Uh, and can I just say, the kebabs, amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can, uh, I can smell it on your breath, the garlic this morning, unbelievable. You've got a wacky kebab, and it's so cheap. Yeah, it's really, really cheap. Happy and, with that? Yeah, the drinks last night, uh, I was on whiskey and coke, it's buy one, get one free. Yeah, yeah. Big mistake, really, though, feeling a bit fragile this morning. Yeah. So let's crack on then and have a look around, eh? Yeah, let's do that. Should we just kiss her? No. It is Christmas Day. You can do this. Hey! Loving life. Loving it. We thought we'd just mention this. Apparently, there's a, a live stream. What do you mean, apparently? You've seen it. Oh, yeah. There we are. <laughs> Bloody hell, there one is of them a, days, There is it? a live stream. There's a live stream and... Uh, we think it's up there somewhere. Yeah, I'll just show you, but the, You're not the, sun, the sun's out, so... On one of those high-rise yeah, blocks there, you can actually go onto it, onto the Benidorm Forum, is it? Yeah, wave. And you can actually see, live. Brilliant, I think it's brilliant anyway. Yeah, yeah. it really is. What's, what's the matter? Just loving it, just loving life. Can't whack it, man. You cannot whack it. The sun is out, it's glorious. And it's a beautiful place to be. So we've just gone a bit further down and up there is the old town, which we're probably going to do tomorrow, aren't we? And also we want to go up to the cross, which is up there somewhere. Yeah, up there where the sun is. <laughs> I think we need to turn that way a bit. There you go. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. Burger King. He's actually taking me out for breakfast, apparently. Yes. You know, we've just gone past the market, which is open on a Christmas, Christmas day. Christmas day, I know, we're going to have a look around that after. Yeah. I love handbags, there's loads of handbags. No handbags, no spending, no more monies. That's what you think. Rob skint. Lynn's not. <laughs> <laughs> Lynn's got all his money. Yeah. 
I've just got to keep panning the camera around because this place is lovely. Look at that Christmas day. The sun is out. I must say, it's very... I'm trying to think of the word. I don't know, it's, un... it's just... Everything seems to be open as normal. All the shops are opening. Yeah, yeah. And pe people starting to pile in already, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. I mean, when we, when we rode past the market earlier, I can't believe the market's on on Christmas Day. We were gutted thinking we were going to miss it. Yeah, yeah. But we're not, because it's on. No. Nope. It's just brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely amazing. We well recommend you to come to Benidorm at Christmas. Yeah. Even, or any time, to be honest. Even people uh, like me who thought, no. Yeah. You've got to give it a try. Yeah, you're very sceptical, weren't you? I was. But I'm loving it. But I've converted you now, haven't I? You haven't, because you've never been. Well, no, but I watch, I watch it on telly enough, don't I? Yeah, police going past us now. Yeah, don't worry, they won't arrest you. Why would they? I don't know, you look a bit dodgy, don't you? Yeah, man. Great place. Benidorm is fantastic. I'm going to try and talk Lynn Rain to stop in another couple of days in Benidorm because I'm loving it. I'm loving the life. I'm loving the atmosphere. I'm loving everything about it. You can't whack a bit of Benidorm. Lots of, lots of people say Benidorm is like Blackpool with the sun. But I, I don't think it's like Blackpool, do you? No. I really don't. I don't, I don't know where very, that saying came from, no, to be it's, honest. Well, it's very, it's not, it's very commercial. <clears throat> I don't know, no, it's you know, it's just too pretty to be anything compared to Blackpool, I'm afraid. It, it's, it's, yeah. it's very commercial, it's very busy, it's... It's made for the Brits. Well, it is. You haven't got to worry about language at all here. No, no, no. I mean, everybody even understands Lynn. Shut up, Robert. She was on the karaoke last night. That's why I'm losing my voice. I Bless her. I can't sing for Toffee. She was singing to me romantically no, in a bar on stage. I wasn't singing romantically at all. I bet you'd love to see the footage. We have got the footage, but we'll get copyrighted so we can't show it. I'm happy with that. <laughs> I'm not moaning. Spoiled again. Knows. Spoiled again. First time, breakfast out. You're, happy with that. you're paying. That's nothing new there, is there? I don't know what it's going to be like. I'm sure this is our first breakfast in Spain. It is. Go on then, crack on. Don't know what I'm going to do. They should come over. Yes, let's hope so. Let's hope so. Having <coughs> breakfast. Looking at that. Not bad, eh? Not too shabby. Happy with that. Crack on. <laughs> You're looking really pretty today. Really not. Hair's just dreadful because we're wearing helmets. It's just not a good look. What do you two want? <laughs> I want a sack of cash, please. <laughs> <laughs> Sat here minding our own business. And they just turn up. Yeah, sat down. Unbelievable. <laughs> Ruining my romantic breakfast. Happy bloody holidays. <laughs> Looks nice, doesn't it? It does, it really does. Come on, people. English breakfast. Looking out at that. Perfect. Mm. Well, people, as you can see behind us, there's a market. When we came past earlier, it was empty. They were just setting up. We've been about an hour for breakfast, come back, and it's absolutely wrapped. Yeah, so we've just locked the scooters up because you're not allowed to take the scooters into the market. Loads of security. Police actually, everywhere. Yeah, police. So, so crime rate around the market must be high. So yeah, I'm gonna hang on to my handbag. Hang on to your husband. No. Uh, come on. Let's crack on. Let's have a look. Yeah, as you can see. There are people everywhere. And it's mad Christmas Day. Who, who? Oh, we thought, oh, we're going to miss it. Got it, but no. Unbelievable. Can I, uh, can I just ask you something? What's that? Why are we walking around the market? Why not? There's lots of handbags. We don't want nothing. We don't need anything. We might need anything, but we always want something. You always want something, don't you? Always. Pants. What's a pants? <laughs> Loads of counterfeit goods on here. Yeah, Michael Kors handbags everywhere, as you'd expect. You know, it's just... Uh... Yeah. Must be legal, though, isn't it? Mm -hmm. No, obviously not. It's not know. legal. It's got to be. You can't... No. 
trading stand. Haven't Spain got a trading stand? There's Louis Vuitton pretend hump bags there. Yeah, there you go. Gucci. Gucci. Hello. 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 Yves Saint Laurent. Who? Yves Saint Laurent. That's, I do like that one, but I don't like Michael Kors stuff. But that's just me. <laughs> I've had enough of filming handbags. Unbelievable. <laughs> What, what, what? Well, it's, saying, it's, just, it's a shame it doesn't say gin, but I've just seen the bag up here and it says beer is proof that God loves us and wants us to be happy. <laughs> happy with that. What are you going to say? Know what you're going to say, so don't say it. Treat on? No. Behave. There you go, that's perfect for you. What's the eight of it? You're horrible, you are to me. <laughs> Unbelievable. And you think you're one? Up that bit, three, two, one. I'm literally dra pushing her along, dragging her along, so it doesn't cost me any euros. Yeah, well, I've got the money. Just cost me 20 euros of bloody breakfast. Oh, it's Christmas. I gave him a three euro tip. Wow. I keep forgetting it's Christmas. Christmas Day. Really doesn't feel like Christmas, it does it? No. When you're in the sun. Not Enjoying yourself. Not rubbing it in at all, people. No, definitely not. Enjoying the rays while we can. Even though I've got a jumper and a gilet on, but I am getting very hot now. I'm getting very hot as well. It's very hard to dress at this time of year because in the daytime it gets like 21 degrees and then on a night when the sun goes in... It drops it's really cool. Freezing. <clears throat> I was just saying, it's just like walking around a market in England because everybody speaks English. Yes, it's mad. Absolutely mad, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> I'm a big kid at heart, check that out. We're not having one, come on. What can you do, mate? Come on, have one. No, come on. Who's your mate? Cute, isn't he? Just like you, my little food cake. Do you enjoy your little run round the market? Well, don't worry, because we're going back now. I'm and not then, going back in there. And then we're all coming down, so we'll all have a walk around the market after. Nah, well, won't happen. You can sit outside. I've got the money. You can sit outside. That's what I'll do then. Happy with that? Then you can't moan, can you? Yeah, so uh, we'll wrap it up here, people. We hope you've had a magical Christmas. Yes, we really do. And, uh, yeah, it's been good. We're still living the dream. Amazing, absolutely loving it, yeah. loving life. Yeah, so stay safe for the caravan as motor owners tend to drift with subscribers old and new. Didn't come out right, did it? Stay safe for the caravan as motor owners tend to drift as subscribers old and new. We, we still love. love you. We do. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you on the next one. In a bit.